Okay, folks, we've talked about decks of cards. We've talked about colors on a cell phone. We've talked about how to lock up your cell phone. We're going to talk one more time using the fundamental counting principle about how your data is kept safe online. Um, any piece of data that you transmit uh, online is encrypted, which means it's turned into a series of ones and zeros that is coded. And on the other end, there's a decoder that decrypts it back into its original information. This is how your, your PayPal payments and your Amazon purchases and your credit card statements and your banking activity, all that stuff is kept safe. Okay, so what I wanna look at is bit encryption, which is one kind of encryption. That's the kind I wanna focus on right now because it's, it's, it's straightforward for us. We're gonna start by looking at what's called an 8-bit encryption. Now, to give you a quick, really, really quick overview as to what a bit is, a bit is a switch in a computer. It's a digital, it's a digital uh, uh, switch. It either is either on or it's off. It's either on, which gives it a value of one, or it's off, which gives it a value of zero. So each bit can have one of two values, either zero or one. In an 8-bit encryption system, a piece of information is brought in and then is converted into 8 bits, which means either 8 values that are either 0 or 1 each. So one of the examples might be 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0. Another one might be 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1, 1. Another more interesting one might be 0, 1, 1, 0, 1, 0, 0, 0. But the idea being that an 8-bit encryption, mecha uh, encryption mechanism is going to be eight numbers, all of which are either zero or one. So the question then is, how many possible 8-bit codes are there? Well, if we think about it mathematically, there are two choices for the first bit because each of the bit each bit can only be a one or a zero, which means it has two choices. The second bit is also two choices. The third bit is also two. The fourth bit is also two, also two, all the way down, which means we end up with two to the eight or 256 possible encryptions, 256 possible codes. That doesn't seem like very many. And even Mario down here, 8-bit Mario, is ex expressing that's nowhere near enough because I'm going to, in the next video, I'm going to show you why 256 possible encryption codes is not enough.